If there isn't a willingness to work with us, why should we be at the table? The African Descent Advisory Committee is cutting ties with the Vancouver Police Department. The committee says they have felt disrespected and their recommendations haven't been considered during decision-making processes. The relationship has been somewhat challenging. Sadie Keene, the former co-chair of the committee, says that police leadership was disrespectful and dismissive of its members. Already made a decision, allow him to speak. You listen to the nonsense, allow this man to speak, please. It's a lost opportunity for the VPD as far as I'm concerned. Keene says the police board's decision to bring back the school liaison officer program before committee members had been invited to speak on the issue was a turning point. Particular students are negatively impacted by having police in schools. Tensions rose when the committee walked out of a board meeting last June over the reinstatement of the school liaison officer program. It is insulting to have people engage and involved in advisory groupings, giving up their time and energy and expertise and skills to advise uh, you on matters when you have already made a judgment call. We value the relationship that we have, um, and that we have had with the African Descent Advisory Committee. On Sunday, we asked the VPD for comment about the committee withdrawing its partnership. We'll be reaching out to them, um, speaking with them directly uh, about the reasons behind their decision. The African Descent Advisory Committee was formed by the police board in 2021 in the response to the murder of George Floyd, who was killed by a police officer in the U.S. That sparked rallies throughout the city as thousands took part in numerous Black Lives Matter protests. But now Keene says her committee was left voiceless. We had the impression that this was a chance to really make a difference because of the outreach from the force itself. They assured us that they were present, that they understood the urgency of having conversations with our community. Keene says the committee would reconsider rejoining if they heard from the leadership of the VPD addressing their concerns. In Vancouver, Angela Bauer, City News.